Everyone, you know what this is, Jesse Lee Peterson, many videos. Jesse, now there was a quote that people are talking about you on social media about, was all the calls to 911 on black people. Yes. Could you tell people, they can hear from you, what's your opinion on that? I understand why they're doing it. White people, Hispanics, and most other cultures are afraid of black people. They don't trust them because most black people, not all, not all, not all, but most black people are very violent. And then they they have almost been given permission to rob and rape and, and and kill white folks because they blame them. And that's been going on for so long. And black people have not self-corrected themselves. And so now the rest of the uh, uh, cultures are afraid of black people. So that's why that's happening. So should white people be afraid of you? You're black. Well, they, they shouldn't be, but because they don't know, uh, unless they know me, they don't know me from any other black person, right? So they should be careful because they don't know me from any other black person. And so when they, like sometimes if I'm walking down the road mm -hmm. and a white person grabs their purse or his hand or whatever, I understand why they do it. Because it's known that black people, black men and women, young black men and women, not all, but most, that they steal, they snatch purses. They deliberately go and do it. Even Jesse Jackson said that when he's walking down the road and he hear footsteps behind, when you look back and see that as white people, he feel better. And so even black people know what we're talking about. So you say that, let's say middle class, upper class income black people, or even some people in, the, in, in certain neighborhoods because they're struggling, you believe the majority of all those groups of black people just steal? I don't believe that they all steal, but, but because it's been going on for so long in the black community and everybody knows it and no one is doing, really doing anything to stop it, you just don't know which one to trust and which one not to. Okay, so make sure we can't trust Jesse either because we, we in the same team. We may rob you, you, know, you don't know. No, 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 we all, we black, so the right. white people got to be afraid of me and you. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, we are we, Yeah, I know, we're afraid of me and you. Right. Right, yeah. it's just because we black. Right. And that's the right way, and that's the right way to be. It's not because we're black, it's because most blacks are so violent. The, they're crime-oriented, and, and they're not being corrected. It's not because of our color, it's due to the lack of uh, more, more character, like a, a belief in God in the black community. Okay, so we get. So you're saying if we get a belief in God, then it's gonna make the white people. Okay, we, if we raise our kids right, get a belief in God, then white people are gonna mysteriously like just not be afraid of us. It won't happen right away, but eventually they will see that where black people have calmed down, they're not violent, they're not stealing, they're not carrying on like they did, like they did at one point, and then so they'll start to trust white uh, black people again. Even black people don't trust black people. You don't trust no black people. I mean, as far as safety is concerned, when you're driving through the hood or when you, even if you're at an all-black event, there's a sense of nervousness that some fight going to break out or just a black person going to act up. And so you hear that from black people about other blacks all the time. Black people say, I don't even go to mostly black events like at a, a fair or some party because they know some fight is apt to, uh, to uh, start up. I was at a Taste of Soul yesterday. A lot of black people, nothing started up. But let me ask you a That's question. Well, <laughs> let me ask you a question. Jesse, wow. Let me ask you a question. Y'all already know about me and Jesse, we had our rounds. So, Jesse, you think I'm violent? Do I think? I don't know for sure, but since I know that you're not the head of your wife, then you, you have the potential of being violent. Do you have a wife? No. Okay, so how you can come in on marriage when you have a wife? Well, Christ didn't have one either. He commented on marriage. So you're saying you're Christ? I'm his son. I'm his brother. He's my brother. And so I know right from wrong. You don't need to be married to know right from wrong. Common sense comes from God. And so you don't have to be married to know right from wrong. And most of the time when someone asks you, are you married? It means that you're right, Jesse. I'm not the head of my wife. Because if you were the head of your wife, you wouldn't ask that question. And yet, Jesse always had to talk about that, but he don't live in my house. But see, I, 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 give, I, give, I give Jesse a pass because I respect my elders. But, but you, know, I, I, you know, I don't trust Jesse either. I don't trust Jesse either because, you know, he black. Your wife? I am definitely the head of my household. I, I asked about the house. The wife is the head of the house. Are you the head of your wife? The household means the wife, children, dog, bills. It means it all. Are you the head of your wife? Jesse, do you have dementia, brother? Are you the head? You didn't answer that question yet. I didn't ask you about the house. I didn't ask you about the dog. I didn't ask you about the finance. I asked you about your wife only.
I think I think Jesse, you developing dementia, brother. Come on now, you are asking the same question and you're not answering. You know, or do you have a listening issue, my brother? I don't care about you, Jesse. I'll listen this time. Are you the head of your wife? I'm the head of my complete household: wife, children, dog, bills, everything. I didn't ask. That's not the question. Are you the head of your wife? Jesse, you have a hearing problem, my brother. You're not answering the question. How many of y'all heard me say that of everything? How many people heard me say it? I didn't ask about everything. Okay. See, they, they, they don't agree with you. You don't agree, right? See, they don't agree with you. We got to wrap it up. All right, everybody. Jess Lee Peterson. Jess Lee Peterson. We'll do a round for another time. You didn't answer the question. Yes or no question. Thank you. You the head of your wife. And the answer, it, but the man is supposed to be the head of his wife. Did you hear me say I'm the head of my household? No, no, no. Wife, children. No, no, no. Okay, if you're not head of your children, then what are you? You said household means everything. Beta. Oh, nice. Beta. Now, we can't even talk if you don't have a woman, Jesse. Uh, air this. Yeah. Make sure you air this, all right? Oh, are we airing it? Are we airing it? No, because, Jesse, because all, right, all right, Jesse. We'll get another time.